this fish. So today I'm going to be showing you how to fillet a coho salmon completely boneless. So what you need is a nice sharp fillet knife, I like these Gerber knives, and a pair of pliers. So with these spring cohos, uh, they don't, the back one isn't really thick, so that will come in later. So I'm going to go in and cut off the elephant. Then I'm going to go ahead and cut off the pectoral fins. I'm going to get real slimy, so sometimes just come up like this. It's a bit easier actually to cut from this way. Just like that. Get your that. And then go ahead and cut off your dorsal fin. Just like that. And then we're going to go ahead and gut this fish. So we're going to start at the anus and we're going to work our way down. Make a nice shallow cut. We're going to go ahead and take out these guts. Like so. And with these spring coals, their back bones are real, real thin, real small. So instead of going, it's real hard, easy to go through the spine. So I'm just going to cut off the head so that we don't miss that spine. And then we're just going to look for that spine. And right here. And we're just going to go follow that spine. Just follow it all the way down. Just keep your knife down at a slight angle, like that. Now get a nice fillet, just like this. And you go ahead, you see this these rib bones on here. So make sure you get all the good sound stuff. You're gonna feel those ribs. So you take your knife, get ribs, and you're just gonna angle your knife upwards against the ribs. Feel those ribs, and then just angle your knife upwards against those ribs. See, I left some still up here, so I'm gonna go back, go again, get all the ribs. Make sure you get all the ribs. You don't want those ribs in there. There's still one in there, so I'm gonna go back in and cut all that boy up in there. There you go. And then the last thing to get out are the pin bones. You'll feel those pin bones all through your finger. And the way I like to get those pin bones out with pliers. So you feel those pin bones with your finger, you can feel them, they start right at the beginning of the fish. Just take your pliers and just pull them out. So they're real, sometimes when those springs are like this, they have real small pin bones, so it can be hard to get out. So you just pull them out one at a time, like so. Get these pin bones out, 
and you just feel the fish. You can feel all the pinballs in there. And you just go down the fish and get all the pinballs out. Yeah, just keep going, getting them pin bones. And that's about it. You get a nice boneless fillet of coal.